what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back i just finished watching episodes 36 and 37 and now we're jumping into 38 and 39 okay um yes yeah, series moving quite along i promised myself that tonight while i'm recording i'm going to be recording six episodes tonight i'm committed to doing it um so that i can have four episodes out on early access for my early access people if you have not signed up for early access you see a lot of people on this channel a lot of y'all come in the other comment sections of my videos and y'all be like where the slam dunk reactions at where was my thursday slam dunk reaction see but y'all ain't want to help support your boy you know what i'm saying like i'm gonna be putting a lot out on early access in the upcoming weeks as i've said before i'm gonna make a conscious effort to get more out on early access so if you want to see the stuff early consider doing it i would appreciate it it's only two us dollars to do that or 199 if you want to call it that and you can have access to those early access video because i'm going to be dropping four extra episodes on slam dunk on tuesday night and by the time well i don't even know why i'm announcing it on this one because this one is going to be on early access so <laughs> by the time you guys on or just on youtube see this the time will already pass <laughs> i don't even know why i'm doing this but anyways consider joining the membership on the channel i really do appreciate y'all um we we started out strong on the membership but then things started to drop off i don't know you know it is what it is at least i appreciate you guys for coming for joining if you joined ever i appreciate you for joining um because i don't want to assume you know anybody's circumstance and you know what they're going through um but in any case if you can afford it and you want to support the channel that is a good way to support the channel there are a couple people still over on patreon i'm going to revamp my patreon also and do different things over there um so there i'm, I'm gonna put some very exclusive content over on patreon that's what i'm planning to do some like an exclusive you know my process and stuff like that like videos of me when i edit in and you know how long it takes me to actually get a video out and stuff like that like exclusive behind the scenes stuff um you know maybe i'll do something like a day in the life of terabyte i'll probably do that but that would probably not fly too much with my girl because she don't like her private life being on the internet she <laughs> she does she, she doesn't like it so um and she's a she's a girl of my own art because i don't really like that either you know what i'm saying that's why i'm not really on social media like that like i'm not on if you notice like i have a twitter for the channel but i'm not really active over there like i'm not really because i'm just not like i feel like one day maybe down the line i'm gonna have to like get a social media presence at least so you guys can at least um you know holla at your boy on those platforms but other than that i'm not in no rush to be on those you know strictly like you know your instagram twitter facebook like i'm not in no rush to do that stuff to be honest because you know i just don't want to have too much doing if, if it's if i'm gonna do any it's not gonna be you know like uh um you know i gotta do it when i feel like i'm in a position to do it you know what i'm saying where i know i'm gonna have the time to pay attention to one or two of them but regardless of it it's what we do so let's jump in to some more slam dunk reactions i'm ready to go i got four more episodes to do so let's go do it man here we go 38 39 okay so we got the player coach you know that decides you know he he the who the hell does he think he is he ain't even gonna show them the respect bruh 
that is some cheese right there but he can make that decision though because he's a player coach um but anyways he didn't think that much of shoku he thought his boys could handle it without him without his genius on the court but now shoku has showed up they have come through ryota with the, the one and only ryota man quick brought us back into the game by making some incredible passes um of course that's what a point guard is supposed to do he's supposed to assist he's supposed to be the floor general you know he's supposed to be the floor general he's supposed to do what you see him doing like hands down that's what he's supposed to be doing so i'm looking forward to seeing what he's going to do next now that he's going to have some sort of competition in the game because this dude that's coming in he's a point guard so i'm guessing they're going to sit someone down to put him in of course that's how basketball works i don't know why i'm pointing that point out but um we'll see how things go we'll definitely see how things go i like how shohoku came back into the game that was very well done um consecutive points shut lockdown defense you know hanamichi getting getting his first points ever that was epic he deserved a ticketer parade that he threw for himself he deserved it you know um so i i like the fact that they show how differently haruko rip um cheers for <laughs> for ruwaka versus how she cheers um well sakuragi or hanamichi whatever right i like how they show that difference um and i think i would rather someone like i i don't i wouldn't want a girl to be simping over me and I, i'm i'm gonna tell you this i'm gonna tell you this why i know why i'm going into this but i'm gonna say it anyways i would never want a girl that's simping over me i don't think that you know i don't think it is it, i don't think it would be truly true respect you get what i'm saying um and in all certain on you know all certain terms of the word you know what is you know a simp is if you don't know what a simp is go look it up okay it's all over the internet these days um you know of what a simp is but in in in, in all other words like why are you so in awe of a or in love if you want to call it that with a person who's never showed any sort of interest towards you like i would never want to be treating a woman like crap and she's still like oh my god i love you so much like bro no <laughs> and if you have a woman that's like that you're a really terrible person if you're keeping a woman like that around you're you're just you're a horrible person i'm not afraid to say it <laughs> you're if you have a woman that's that's oogle over you like like that kind of oogle to those kind of levels simping levels nah bruh that's 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 a problem if you take advantage of that if you are taking advantage of that stop it <laughs> okay stop it um so i like how they made that distinction that was pretty cool i said it's not gonna be a long review the game is going on i like that they came back did their thing to come back in the game um you know and everybody rukawa listen there's no denying his skill he's a talented basketball player he's a skilled basketball player he's damn near a genius basketball player he can do everything he can shoot the mid-range he can do he can shoot the long range he can do layups the man is he's rukawa you get what i'm saying i've never doubted that part of him like he would never be able to play we all know this what i had a problem with i think it was a couple of episodes ago they were kind of portraying him as this loner on the team that you know what i'm saying he's just doing his own thing or whatever and i was hoping that it doesn't break the chemistry on the team it doesn't seem like it's affecting the team in any way um i love their chemistry how they rag on each other about certain things and stuff like that i i love that because on a team even though you're on a team it's good to have a competition it's good to have you know what i'm saying like you can go out there and be like hey today i'm gonna score more points than you and i'm saying i know you the leading scorer on the team 
but I'm going to put in work today and get more points than you. You see, stuff like that, you know what I'm saying, where you have your teammate and you know it's not a malicious intent, it's good for the team. You get what I'm saying? Um, you know, so that's good. It's good competition, you know, amongst, you know what I'm saying? It, it's, I love to hear, like, when I when I watch the NBA and I and 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 I watch the after game interviews and you hear them talk about certain things that they do on the team, they make bets. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know what I mean? Like it it helps to build chemistry because it's not about ego. You know what I'm saying? Like everybody's ego can be out the door. You have a a good team. You go eat together. You know what I'm saying? You go eat together. You you know you spend time outside of the the game together you do things together um so it's really cool you know what i'm saying on the lakers when 80 came over to the lakers and you know lebron have the taco tuesdays he would have anthony davis over for taco tuesdays and stuff stuff like that when you see stuff like that that's the true mark of what leadership is and it's something that i practice in my own life with people that i know so i know for a fact that that builds chemistry with a team regardless of what it is you're doing whether it's competitive sports whether it's business whether it's just you know family you know what i'm saying it builds rapport because there's plenty of times in my life where i've met up you know met family that i've never i've heard of that part of my family never met them came to america met them you know what i'm saying and i would say hey let's go here you know what i'm saying let's go to starbucks let's go have some coffee and get to know each other you know what i'm saying you're my cousin i've heard about you for years never really known you yes i'm saying it's a good way to start build build chemistry between you in person and build rapport and you know what i'm saying and, and you know you're gonna catch up you know what i'm saying even though you never known this person it's just a good way to do things you know because some people may not even feel comfortable inviting you so you can step up and be that person you know so i really do like what they're doing with this series man um going forward we're definitely going to take some steps in and step in you know what i'm saying i see some elements man that you guys have told me about i see those elements like they're coming through you know step by step and i see where you guys are saying that this potentially you know is could be the goat of sports anime but that's yet to be seen by me but i'm seeing the steps i'm seeing the steps i'm seeing the little things that they do that could hold in high regards so i'll see you guys for the next one i got two more for the night let's get it i'll see you guys make sure to like the video man don't forget to like the video don't forget to comment of course i'll catch you guys later peace